Hello and happy holidays to everyone. For Christmas, I received this. And this is a um, laser printer, my brother. It is a HL2170W. That's the uh, model of this printer. And it, from what I've heard, it's got really good reviews. And I'm very impressed with it. I've set it up. Unfortunately, I deleted the unboxing video by accident. So, um, this will be sort of a review of it. And, um, after unboxing it, print out the test page, of course. And these are some things. This is the test page, which got wrinkled somehow. Um, so yeah. And that is. Here's pictures that I printed. This is probably the best quality one. The others are, they're, they're good quality, but on the computer, they just kind of look bad because of all that spots. But they're still great quality. And then this one. Which all of this of here, that's all on the computer. That's not the printer. So, but again, this is probably the one that has really good, that's the best quality. So as you can see, it's high quality printing. And it's fast, too. These are extraordinarily fast. And, um, well, just how fast? I shall prove you. I shall show you. There is the printer over there, next to my setup. It's just not too much room. I have to find other places to store my stuff now. Because, although it doesn't take up much room, I'll admit, it actually fits perfectly right here. It's got the toner right in there. And it also has a paper tray of 250 pages. So, it's nice and large. And um, it has a print rate of 23 pages per minute, which is quite impressive, in my opinion. But, um, again, this is laser, but it's only black and white. It is not color. And although it is, um, it's very good, though, because, I mean, even though people, you know, color, you might, you, people say, oh, black and white, I don't really want that. I mean, even in black and white, this is still an amazing picture. So, I mean, if you really don't print that much in black and white, this is the way to go. Plus, it's get, for the, I think it's a $50 toner, you get 2,000 pages, and for a $60 toner, you get, you get 2,000 um, pages, so, did I, for the $50 turn, you get 1,000 pages. And um, so, yeah, now it does take a while to warm up, so I've already done that. If you know, work with laser printers, you know they take a little bit to warm up. But once they do, they are fast. So, I'm going to print a picture just to show you. It's going to go into the default pictures. And I'll show you it on here. Let's print this one, okay? I decided to print with the camera. This picture on this uh, here, you print that picture. Now this is a USB connected printer. This printer supports three different printing methods. Let me get you right over the printer. It supports um, or three different connection methods. Here. It supports um, USB, obviously. It also supports built LAN and has a built-in Wi-Fi. But the nice thing is, what I have right now is I have it hooked up to USB for, for my computer. But I also have it hooked up Wi-Fi, so all the other computers in the household can use it. But I have a direct USB, which is faster, because, you know, my router is through walls. And that does slow it down. It is a little bit... I'll show you... I'll do a demo of, um, from, from LAN. But uh, first this. All right, so, let's control P. Ready. This is from... I'm going to click, and it'll render, and send to here. So when I click, it'll start. Ready, go. And sent. The light is flashing which means it has a processing a job and there we go starting up took a page but sort of flipped it there and print there's the picture a little warm but yeah great quality just amazing quality for the for the you know speed so, here we go, and um, it does not, it, I don't think it has um, automatic um, two-sided, so, although, I mean, I don't, I mean, the speed, I was you just print it all out, put it in there again, and it'll print on the back. So, now I'm going to print, now I'm going to print wirelessly, okay, this is the same picture, I'll see if I can find it, the same picture, uh, go, yeah, okay, same picture wirelessly. No print. No. Okay. 
Oh, just wanted to do a slideshow. Hold on. Just a second here. Okay, ready. All right, and printing sent. So it's going to the Wi-Fi. This is wirelessly, by the way. And it is now receiving the job. Starting up. So it's not that bad. It is a little slow, but it's not that bad. And there it is. Same quality. It's still really nice quality. So, yeah, there you go. I mean, you can time that if you want to, but it's still good quality regardless. And it's really a great printer. I mean, I like it a lot. Now, I haven't, you know, if it actually holds true to how many pages a toner can go, then I'm going to be satisfied with this printer. I would give it probably 5 out of 5 stars. If it, now the thing is I haven't tested that long. And if it does, you know, give me a thousand pages, I would give it 5 out of 5 stars because it's, the other thing is it's compact. I mean, although it's a little bit larger, it's actually probably the same size as your, as your inkjet, maybe a bit larger. But I mean, it's got a compact design though. It's not, you know, everything bulging out. This folds up when you don't want it, when you want it, it's right there. And this is, I guess, for like envelopes and stuff. I'm not quite sure what that's for, but it's there. And then this is for the standard paper, so you can lift it up easy. But, um, and it also, now I'm going to show you the wireless features. It's, if I hold this down for 10 seconds, wait until it starts to blink. There you go. It's going to print the wireless setup page, which will give it its. So when you're configuring, because you have some issues on your wireless, boom, you have all the data that you need right there. <coughs> Excuse me. So, this is a nice sheet to have. And it'll tell you, you know, all the stuff that you need to know about your wireless, including all the settings, which is nice to know. So, and another feature it does when you're trying to set it up for Wi-Fi, but the one of the, the best feature I like about it is that I can hook up to USB and wireless at the same time, which is nice. So, that's one of the, you know, bonuses I like about it. I'm not sure if it intended, the original design was intended to do that, but it, I've done it. So, now, I had to hook it up, I actually had to take it downstairs to my router, use the LAN cable, and hooked it up, because I think if you have a Wi-Fi, if you have a password, you need to do that. So, and then once it's done, unplugged it, took it upstairs, and then plugged in the USB. And, but I, I want the USB because when I'm printing a lot of documents, it says if you're printing like a large job, the USB or LAN is the best way to go because wireless is, you know, slower. So, but again, you can do both, which is really nice. I, you know, that's my opinion. It's really great that you can do both. So, you know, so it's that sort of best of both worlds. I can print fast on here and all the other computers in the house can print. So yeah, so that's the review of it. And um, it was really easy to set up. I mean, all I did was took it downstairs, plugged it in. Software really took care of everything. You pretty much, I mean, you really didn't enter anything at all. It's really easy to set up. The drivers are really easy to set up. But once you have it configured, all you do is just click, you know, install driver only. And it'll install the driver and it's a really good printer, I'd say. So, um, happy holidays and thanks for watching this video. And please rate and comment. And if there's anything you want to see demo of that I haven't demoed, just you know, put it in the comments and I'll see if I can get around to it. Thanks so much for watching.